you say. The last thing I remember is a lot of dancing, and definitely not all these trees. Rui, Pat, Richard, Sam, Mark, Sam, is there anyone around here? The sound is a little loud on my headphones. Alright, there we go. Alright, you can kind of walk through these trees, that's good to know. I don't know why it's TNR. Oh, shiny treasure! No, I got stuck on a rock called trees. Darn it! These trees, they disguise themselves as rocks. I have been duped. No, you <laughs> this is an unfortunate conundrum. Alright, well, that didn't happen. Let's try that again. All right. Found a marathon ring. Put the ring on. Okay. Well, let's put the ring on. Huh? Oh, you got bald. Ah, my hair. <laughs> <laughs> this artwork, it's like Jamie's artwork. It's awesome, I love it. It's so bad, it's great. <laughs> it's so great, it's bad, I love it. They're bad. It's yeah, great. see, Shh. what's that sound? Oh no, I'm flying. Uh, uh, yeah, go with that. Go with that. Shoot it, kill it. Nice. T brings up the battle moon news. Choose from the four types of attack. Okay, got it. Got it. Yeah, use it. Okay, he's red. You so can he's move blue. before you attack. Hold on. Oh, I was gonna say. That Wait, I can move. Yeah. You're using the you use um you use green on the red guy. Oh, you can move. He's gonna hurt you. Oh my goodness. Yo, this is pretty awesome considering this seems like it's got lots of action moves in. Gust. <laughs> oh, okay, that was short lived. I guess I'm supposed to attack the red guy. I would just fire on him. I can't tell if I'm actually hitting the. Hitpoint's I can't move to either. Oh, there we go. Now I can move. Stuck on a rock, that's good. I might have to go with a pulse combo version. Ah, <laughs> oh, there we go. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to actually move right after I attack. Oh, I see. No. This game looks pretty cool, Jamie. And it looks like your art. <laughs> but no, but check out the attacks you can do. It's okay, like, now I'm actually all, like, it. area effect based like RPG stuff. Which is pretty interesting actually. Uh, uh can I cancel that? Yes. Yeah, yeah I, like, I like the answers quite a bit actually. Okay, that did something. Victory! Alright. Is this all because this because I picked up a ring? Possibly. There are four elements. 
Impulse is purple and favors bounds. It can often pierce high defense. Okay. Uh, red. Force is red and quite powerful, but it is costly. Demi Quartz is a like quartz, but more expensive and less powerful. It is poorly understood and rarely used. Quartz is a source of all four and can be used directly. It is weak but cheap. Alright, well, looks like we're gonna go fireball all the time. See? Alright. It's pretty neat. I mean, they are great. <laughs> I think the trees are happy. Uh, nope, looks like I'm out of range. I don't know. Did I hit anything? I guess not. Oh, it is actually turn based. Huh. Go for it. such that I can totally beat both of them. I totally did not hit them at all. What the crud. I'm getting bad Mystic Quest flashbacks. <laughs> What's going on? Well, you know what's also plausible? Nope. Still ineffective. I may die very early. Survive this one. You're defeated. Continue. I have nine continues left. New spell unlocked. Well, 
music is kind well, of extraordinary. Well, at least my health regenerates. I should avoid all rocks. And trees. I should avoid everything. Come at me, bro. Let's do the same thing again. I know it takes up my entire MP, but whatever. Yeah, you do that. I'm just gonna kind of hug the tree there. Alright, that doesn't work. Let's do that. Victory! I'm just gonna stand here and recover rapidly. Come back here, you thief. Ree, what? I'm not a thief. We'll see about that. Nothing. Alright, how about Gust? Did one thing. Ouch. Fireball, do you do anything? Yes, you do. You suck, though. Alright. Lots of experimentations done. Let's just keep using what works. Without experience bar, I'm kind of having a hard time telling how much when I'm gonna level up eventually and so forth. Does to anything. I don't understand what Ray does. No, that does nothing. Come on. Of course the bald man has a hot, hard time. Are you able to figure out the fighting now? 
I understand how to fight, I don't understand how to dodge. I don't know why I'm rapidly losing MP. Like victory is happening for a while. Yeah, go for it. Uh, this is the end of me. You are defeated. Continue? Sure. Gained a level in force. New spell unlock. Gained a level in impulse. New spell unlock. What was his deal? I kinda don't want to touch you guys. Don't touch me. Alright. Don't you think this is like the greatest artwork ever, Astra? It's pretty good. <laughs> The, there is something I genuinely endearing about this. Yeah, it's very uh, Mystic Quest. Not Mystic Quest. Uh, what's the game? Magic Quest for the N sixty four, the one that's like infamously panned. Why is this so tiny? Darn it. version of this, to be completely honest. Hitting on the bald guy. <laughs> Did that make me stronger? Faster? Weird that this is actually a turn based RPG instead of a real time RPG. So it's kind of weird to me. I won't fault that on the developer, however, it's just something that I'm not used to. Alright, that's one down. So far I level up every time uh, I die, which is good to know. And the only way I can seem to hit enemies is if, I, is if I'm just stand right next to them pretty much. It's a winning strategy. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oop. Alright, you guys regenerate, that's good to know. I'm just gonna keep grinding until uh, I get all my MP and my HP back. 
That's not even grinding, that's just standing still. <laughs> Does anyone else like to join in on my epic RPG journey? <laughs> so far, we just woke up from a party and we lost all our hair. It reminds me a lot of um, One Pump Man. Mm. Oh man. Now I'm just gonna hug you guys right here and wow. So yeah. The using how much MP it's going to do kind of foreshadowing is really deceiving. There we go, yeah. I do appreciate the little blinking, that's really... That makes it a lot easier. Oh. Back to back. Where's my boundaries? What happened to the boundaries? Alright. Well, I'm just gonna hide behind a tree, because that's the smartest thing to do. Uh... Can't choose that. You can listen to the audio too if you like. My extension cord is here. Hmm. Yes, it is. Actually, I did forget that. I'm just gonna stall time until I can recover MP. Ouch. You seem really into this game though. Ouch. They have long range attacks. What am I gonna really do? Really long range. Yeah. That is the problem. Alright, well, if you're gonna be that way, I'm gonna fireball you until you collapse on my second shot. After I recover my MP of hiding behind a rock. <laughs> Thanks, Rock. You were very helpful. Oh man, look at my smiling face. It shows no pain. Rui, you're a man of a man. <laughs> Showing no fear and smiling, even at the mercy of falling over. An exhaustion. It is like one punch man. <laughs> uh I could I could try to stall it by um Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. No. Take that little I don't even know what you are. One-eyed demon thing. It's a one-eyed? It's one-eyed. There's like only one eye. I thought it was like Mr. Plankton or something. It looks jellyish. I suppose. Well, this banged bat with a Santa Claus hat. <laughs> It will know the true power- oh wait, what? That missed? I didn't- I did not see it yet, so probably. Hadouken! Hiya! Gee, alright, so last time I was playing around with- funny with this guy, I just didn't remember that. It looks like you have to attack no matter what, there's no way to defend- Why did that hit me? Wow. Yeah, exactly. What is happening with that rock?! <laughs> so many questions! Jamie, do you have an answer? Uh... Looks like it's bouncing around like everything else. Why? What did it do to you? What did that it's rock cut off in half by the river! Oh, that rock, I see. Oh, what? 
Oh wow. It multiplied? Yeah, that's not happening. There are some graphical problems right now. Ouch. That is a really long range attack. Um, Why? Wow. Why? How is, how is the ta what is the targeting? I don't get it. Why are they able to hit me? I, I have no idea. Then I have to fight this in the only way I know how. to be a little more eff well but no that seems to be as equally effective as fireball and fireball cost less it might be a glitch but when you select the skill mm -hmm. the MP says that is gonna consume that much. Yeah it's, and it's, then it just consumes a lot more yeah it consumes <laughs> like double or something. Could just be a glitch. Goo monster, you are now my friend. Uh, that one. I'm probably not gonna survive this one. It probably, yeah. It all aims to the what it thinks is the weakest enemy, which is interesting. Spell is not effective. Oh man. I die. Alright, well. Don't know what that did. Uh, wow. He died. Nope, still alive. Yeah. Oh my goodness. There's more. There's more. Oh, oh, they just respawn. Darn you! Uh, I don't think you can win this game. This is just okay. Yeah. Oh. Oh. I got Tales of Symphonia away. What? Push him before he gets to town. Ah! It's a trap! That hits everything. Yeah, that did something. Victory! Go up, go up, go up, go up. Oh, my health bar disappeared. Oh. Wow. Impulse has a special property. Fire can damage tough foes and lightning can zap quick ones. But its raw power is less than force, right? They are situationally useful. Am I ever glad to see you? I'm assuming you're not with psychotic fish monsters, that is. You are safe within this town, sir. Also, perhaps... Referring to the recent theft of a precious rim? Huh? How could you possibly know about that already? News travel fast around this part. So, that ring. Oh no, I think I made a big mistake. You should talk to our mayor. I think he is home now. He can probably guide you towards the right action. Oh man, things have gone deep. The plot has thickened. Movement casting takes damage. Movement casting and taking damage. Excuse me? Doing <laughs> the often, often enough, we're in stats will improve correspondingly. 
Okay, so taking damage actually increases your defense. But really? because there's no stats here, you can't tell by how much. That's what it's saying. Green magic has elements of all other colors. And yet, there is always a better, cheaper spell of another color. Maybe it's be maybe it's not being used efficiently or even correctly. So so far we haven't hit any monster with a weakness of ray, for example. The mayor. Hi, Anthony. That I am. How can I help you? I think I stole something by mistake. Also, why can fish talk? You seem like a fish out of the water yourself. So perhaps your mistake was an honest one. But. The couriers, the fish people, will be wanting the ring back. Let me see the ring. Interesting. It has bound to your finger. I think you'll have to keep it for now. Nonetheless, you should apologize. The couriers can often sense intention and will likely forgive you. Great, let's go find them. Actually, you'll be going alone. Town ordinance prohibits me from leaving for extended period periods of time. <laughs> That's pretty much the lamest excuse I've ever heard. Well, consider that I've been harried since some bumbling burglar snatched the race's precious national symbol. Then again, going alone could be fun. <sighs> you, you got... You got <laughs> well, uh, who, who raised this kid? <laughs> Off you go then! You seem really into this though, so are you playing the whole thing? <laughs> we, I mean, we try to play a lot of oh, wow. enemies already. I mean, how long is this like a full RPG? Like, there was supposed to be a vast sick. world map, but I ran out of time. So here are three guys you need to apologize to. I hope you enjoy it, Seth. Wait, no, I refuse to apologize right now. I have to go back. Welcome to Doreen. Oh. Listen, I'm sorry about stealing your ring. I can sense you are truly sorry. It is forgiven. <laughs> I'll return the ring if you can never get it off. I'm really sorry for taking it. The ring was made to be used. Perhaps it is better this way. <laughs> I'm sorry I took this ring. I wasn't really thinking. Ignorance is a dangerous excuse. No. Ignorance is a dangerous excuse. Ex 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 My nominal forgiveness changes nothing. Now be gone. All right. Um, well, one thing I know for sure: a lot of GUI work is necessary because I couldn't tell that this was a turn-based RPG. And like I said, I think it gives me that N64 game vibe that was infamously well known to be pretty bad. Um, in regards to like the whole RPG elements and whether I think it's working or not. Um, Having your placement be correct and have it based off of, you know, whether you're going to be damaged or not is actually a really clever idea, and I personally like that. But the enemy movements are generally hard to predict. And mo more importantly, one thing that I had a hard time dealing with was that the enemies can e attack you from, like, the farthest distance that you can ever imagine, which was really peculiar, to be quite honest. So. I don't know, the game left me with more questions than answers, to be completely honest. Uh, well, let's rate it. No, beaten by the blue guy. Uh, well, innovation. I feel like, you know, as a turn-based RPG, I definitely, uh... I think like a lot more polish could have been made, but in regards to having a movement based and you have a small circle you need to be stayed within, there has been in fact games that did do that before as well. Nonetheless, I do think it's a considerably solid effort, so it's going to be worth doing that. Maybe I had a little too much fun. I don't know. It's kind of average to me. Uh, the theme was very magic. <laughs> I, I don't really have much more to add to that. It's, you know, magic. Uh, graphics. Should I give him five stars? I should give him five stars. For <laughs> <graphics>. <laughs> <laughs> um, I know it's a silly rating. Um, I'm going to notch that down by one. <laughs> there is something really endearing about the graphics. I actually like the graphics. Yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, like, there's a certain sense of consistency with everything bouncing around. They're definitely ridiculous. They're consistently ridiculous. So, I like the way it was. Give it a three. Come on. Because UI is considered the graphics, too, and there was... The audio was genuinely strong. Uh, granted, I think like a lot of the music was kind of repetitive, so that's going to get one down to average. But I genuinely think that the audio was on the strong side of things. You had a lot of sound effects implemented. And yeah, it's a turn-based RPG, so a lot of things don't feel like they, they have to have weight. Or a lot of things don't have weight, but I mean, the, the genre doesn't demand for that either. And in any case, I thought that the audio was actually one of the stronger suit in this game, so... Yeah, humor. Um, well, there was that part where you had to apologize to a fish. Mood. Uh, you were laughing. Okay. I was laughing when he burned his hair off in the beginning. <laughs> yeah. It's kind of ridiculous. I gave it four stars. Mood. Um, the atmosphere was, you know, yeah, nice. meh. Uh, kind of like an average entry to me. But I definitely kind of like these turn-based RPGs. Yeah, yeah, I felt like it was... Gen really unfair in a lot of places, so I, a lot of improvements could have been made. Um, no, play the compo version. Those enemies has the longest of the longest ranged attacks. Also, the MP meter depletes rapidly. Uh, depletes more than the indicator. More than the... Use up... Uh, attack uses... Indicator indicates... Some status window letting me know the character's strengths would have helped. Oh well, had a bit of fun anyways. I'm trying to think if it was called Mystic Quest on 64 or 64 or something. Quest 64? Quest 64, you're right. Reminded me of a lot of Quest 64. I don't know if that's a good thing. <laughs> oh, Quest 64, man. That game, huh? Yeah, it's... A game. Any requests? I think actually 